Hey, this is Randy Velker with Technophobics Anonymous. Uh, welcome back. Today we're going to be uh, looking a little bit about what Google is interested in trying to do with the internet. Um, at, we've given you a lot of tools on how to start surfing the internet, how to start using the internet, how to start using email. Um, and uh, uh, let's go ahead and, and go to our Gmail account, our Google email account, and uh, we'll be able to talk a little bit about what the big picture is ultimately and what is happening with the internet and with our documents and email and um, content. All right, so let's pop on over there. Um, <clears throat> all right, this is the email, uh, my inbox. I don't have any uh, email. Uh, in there right now to be in the inbox to be moved over to the star or to be you know sent over to uh, to be archived or to be put into different labels like we have down here um, <clears throat> but notice what's happening up here in the upper left hand corner right? it says right here we're in Gmail okay the one right next to it however is a calendar if you click on that you're going to be going to Google Calendar now this is a, a uh, program that allows you to plan out your your days, your weeks, your months, um, and as far out in the future as you want to. Uh, it's very powerful. Um, we're going to be coming back and explaining to you how to use that in some of our further um, uh, courses. But uh, you have the school the skills right now to get in there and start playing with it. If you can figure it out, then by all means, start using Google Calendar. It's it's a very powerful interface in with um, Gmail. Uh, the next one over it is called it's uh, called Google Documents. Let me go ahead and click on that one. Right. Uh, welcome to Google Docs. Very, very simple. Get started with Google Documents. Um, what they're trying to do with Google Documents is they're trying to um, have a place stored on Google servers where you can uh, do any Word documents that you need. If you have to write a letter, you just pop open a Google Doc, um, type it on in. You can format it the same way that you would format things in your um, word processing program on your own computer. But you're doing it all, and it's being stored on Google's server. Right? And then what you're going to do is you're going to store all your documents on Google's server. Right? It's, called, it's called a cloud server. Right? So, uh, it, you know, because it's out there in the clouds somewhere is what, they, is what they call it. But ultimately what you want is you want all of your documents being stored by Google somewhere. And they'll do this. And they'll do it for free. Right? Whether they're Excel type documents, spreadsheet documents, whether they're word processing documents. Um, all of this can be uh, stored up on Google's. And then when you come into your documents, you can sort through and organize and delete, get rid of, basically... Um, you're going to have access to these documents anytime you have access to the internet. So anytime you have a, uh, access to the internet, you'll be able to go in, use your password, you get into your email, and then you can click over and look at all your documents. You can send your document right then, and you can attach that document to an email if you want to, or however you want to do it. But it's very, very powerful what um, Google is trying to do. They're trying to make a complete suite of services uh, so that it doesn't cost anything to you as the end user, and uh, you can basically do have, say, unlimited power at your fingertips. Now, you have the skills now uh, to take what I've shown you uh, and to go out there and start surfing, start using the email, start using... Uh, now, in one of our uh, further courses, we're going to be talking about exactly how to use Google Documents, but feel free. I mean, if, with what you have right now, you know, get out there and get started and start using it. It's, it's a great system the way they have it set up. Um, uh, I, I, I hope you've enjoyed, enjoyed this course. I've certainly enjoyed going through this. Uh, and uh, I look forward to, to bringing you uh, even uh, some more advanced levels of stuff uh, in the future. All right, thanks.